to take a few minutes and talk about some of the web hosts that I've either had experience with directly or indirectly. I'm going to specifically go over four hosts for your website. And I'll start with the number one choice that I personally use and am extremely happy with. I've been using InMotion hosting for several years now and have had hardly any downtime. I would estimate that I've had maybe a half an hour downtime in the five plus years. That I've had their service. That's pretty good for a web host. Um, also, another good thing about InMotion hosting is that they have multiple data centers that you can actually choose where your website's primarily hosted from. Um, so if you're on the west coast of the United States, your site can be hosted there and it'll be closer to you, which gives you better speeds. Number two on my list is Bluehost. This is not one that I had direct experience with, but I've talked to a lot of people who really like the Bluehost service, and it seems to come up again and again as one of the leaders. Uh, the third one that seems to come up again and again, and I've seen very good reviews online, and uh, a lot of people seem to be pretty happy with, is DreamHost. Uh, they specialize in WordPress hosting. They have a lot of different plans, uh, and occasionally they'll have an exceptionally good deal on there too for your first year. Um, number four on my list is GoDaddy. Uh, I put this on the list not because it's the best, but because it's one that I've used directly. Um, my most recent domain, nickleffler.com, is actually hosted with GoDaddy. And it started out a little bit rough. There was a lot of downtime on the website. Um, you know, I'd have 18 minutes here, 20 minutes there. Um, significantly more downtime than Emotion Hosting. I wouldn't recommend them above InMotion, but I'm putting them on this list because they've been a pretty good value service. Um, you know, it's good value for the money. Uh, it's not real expensive for the service, uh, but then again, you're you're also not getting the absolute best. Uh, but for most websites, it's enough. Um, you know, again, I went through some growing pains with my website when I first opened it. There were some up and down times on the server, but uh, since then, it's stabilized uh, quite a bit, so things seem to have gotten better. So those are the four services that I've either had direct experience with or recommend. Um, the two that I've had direct experience with is InMotion Hosting and GoDaddy. Uh, and between those two, InMotion Hosting is definitely the best option. Um, and the two that I've heard a lot of good about is Bluehost and Dreamhost. And I've definitely heard the most about Bluehost. So between those two, I would probably say Bluehost. So if you're going to go for a web host, I would either go with InMotion Hosting or Bluehost. If you have any recommendations or have had bad experiences with any of these hosts, uh, please feel free to leave a comment. And if you also have a host that I missed that's really exceptional and you feel you'd like to share that with people, also feel free to leave a comment. Music